Why are meerkats so cute? I'm gonna share with you three things that make meerkats not only cute, but also pretty cool. So you ready? Join the safari and let's get started. First up is the meerkat's nose. Meerkats are known to strongly rely on chemical signals for social communication, such as marking their territory or establishing social dominance. But secretions from a sac by the base of their tail actually contain chemical information about their age and their standing in their social group, but more importantly, be able to help them tell the difference between kin and non-kin. After all this talk of odors, it should come as no surprise that meerkats have well-developed olfactory olfactory brain structures to help them process this information. But olfactory clues aren't only useful for distinguishing between friend and potential foe, but also looking out for food. By using a combo of digging and sniffing, they are able to find some of their favorite grub. And yes, a majority of their diet is in fact insects, but sometimes can include birds, lizards, snakes, eggs, and even plant material like roots. The other cool thing about meerkats is their memory. Now you may have heard the phrase sentinel. This is the term for the meerkat that's pretty much on guard duty, keeping an eye out for the rest of the mob of meerkats. Now when their shift starts, they announce the beginning with a specialized call. Then throughout, they make a low, constant peeping noise known as the watchman song. However, if a predator is spotted, the guard will raise the alarm and meerkats will run to the nearest hole. And this is where their memory comes into play. Meerkats memorize the locations of thousands of bolt holes within their territory and thus are able to run to the closest one when the alarm is raised. They might be thinking, how are all these thousands of bolt holes created? We'll enter in the third thing about meerkats that make them quite cool. While they are good diggers and they certainly have some sharp claws to help them be efficient diggers, they typically live in burrows created by others, like ground squirrels. However, sometimes when you move into another person's burrow, you may need to make some modifications to ensure that there are chambers at various levels, with some being as deep as two meters. Having a space this far below the ground helps keep the temperature constant, regardless of what temperature is at the surface. But like I mentioned, to get to these depths, sometimes you may need to take matters into your own claws and dig. This is where it's really cool. The meerkats can actually close their ears in order to stop dirt from getting in their ear cavities when they're digging. Isn't that amazing? Be sure to leave this video a thumbs up. To keep your adventure going, why not check out my playlist right here on real life animals that are like Pokemon. Go on, click it. I'll see you over there. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in that playlist.